I am not the brightest person in the world, but I know what racism is. And I know what racists are. Racists are scum, cowards and bullies. What we actually need is education, an ongoing education. We need a zero tolerance. We actually need some role models in this country starting at the top. We haven't got a prime minister who actually does anything about racism whatsoever. He does nothing. He's not interested. And he's been racist in the past. We need good role models at the top. So we need to look at him and we need to get rid of him as soon as we possibly can. We've got Farage and Tommy Robinson who have divided the country with Boris Johnson and he made it an us versus them country. And that's not right. We've also had Trump and Trump has been horrendous for everybody. And he, he is another racist. The thing we've got to do as a sport in society is have a zero tolerance. And that means taking proper action. Black players shouldn't have to go on their knees to make a point. They should just be able to say the words, we have been, we have been actually insulted. And we should actually get on to the FA and put pressure on the trade unions and all the governments should be putting pressure on everybody that this is not acceptable. If somebody comes out on the pitch and says something racist, their club should be docked the points. If somebody in the crowd says something racist, their club should be docked the points. If there's a, t a country that goes into a competition and the players have racist insults hurled at them, then that country should be thrown out. We should not have any racist comments in this country at all. We have to look at the media because the media fuel that because they wanted Brexit. I played with some absolutely fantastic players from all over the world and all they cared about was sport and playing the sport. Racists would find something else to body people with and that is the problem. That is the problem with racists, basically. They're cowards and they're bullies, so they look for a vehicle to find. And at the moment, because we have been divided, then they jump on the back of racism. But I'll tell you, racism will never win because love will conquer everything, I think. And the love for each other and the multicultural Britain that we've got will grow and grow and grow. And that is the best thing we can ever say about Great Britain. It will grow and it will welcome people. How dare somebody suggest that somebody come from war to war country should actually be moved to another country while they seek asylum? That is disgusting. We need to treat everybody with respect and dignity. It doesn't matter what colour you are or where you're from. If you can do the job and you're the best at the job, you'd have that. So we have to create an equal opportunity and we need a society that cares for absolutely everybody not just a few, not based on the colour or the sexuality. We need a, a proper society. And to get that, we're going to have to get off our bums. I'm going to have to vote. I'm going to have to make the politicians work for us. Thank you very much for listening to my rant. And have a nice evening.